We are headed to the third, oh my god. <laughs> we got it all in our hands. And then let go of it so easily. We say it all in I just checked into my room at East 7 Hostel here in Brenzlauerberg. Hey. This is Lucy. Now we're just going for a walk. Uh, this is one of the prettiest neighborhoods in Berlin. Beautiful day. We see the sun, we see the trees. The sky is blue. We see the laughter. <laughs> Everything's good. We're at Mauer Park. It's just a short, maybe 10, 15 minute walk from East 7 Hostel, and we're just checking out the flea market. Now it's a new day. I gotta say, it ain't the same. Set Clear as the sky, sharp as the. If there's one place to spend a Sunday in Berlin, it is definitely Mauer Park. Not only is there a really large flea market, but they also have a huge gathering of people doing karaoke. As you can maybe tell, I've kind of lost my voice a little bit. I don't know why, this happens to me all the time. I should probably do something about it. But I definitely need to stop having dairy, and I've been drinking a lot of milk in things which is stupid because I have a show on Wednesday at East 7 Hostel and if I sound like this it's not gonna be a very good show so what are we doing we're gonna go get cupcakes all right Jake thoughts on the cupcake my name's Sam okay sure so I really liked it. I thought it was a bit sweet. It, well, it was a cupcake, so. <laughs> Today's really a perfect example of why I came up with this concept for the Foreign Voices Travelers Tour. I didn't really want to do a typical tour where you're on the road for a couple weeks and you're playing a new city every night. And as cool as that is, it basically means you spend 12 hours on a bus, sound check, eat, play a show, and spend another 12 hours on a bus. And while I do hope that that's an experience I have at some point in my life, right now I'm really interested in actually getting to know the places I'm performing in. So for example, this week I have two shows in Berlin. They're spaced almost a week apart, which means that I get to do stuff like this. I'm just wandering around Tiergarten. I have absolutely no agenda. And it's really nice. It turns out that in Berlin, there's a place where you can rent rollerblades for 24 hours for only 10 euros. So even though I actually don't know how to rollerblade, we're gonna go do that. If you're wondering where I am, this is Tempelhof. It is an abandoned airport here in Berlin, and it's now a public park which means it's the perfect place for me to pretend to know how to rollerblade. Also, I think it's really important to note that I am not condoning skating without a helmet. It's really stupid. I'm being dumb. Don't follow my example. You can rent helmets. I don't know why I didn't. I'm sorry, Mom. Wear a helmet when you skate. That's about it. I keep dreaming. Jake, any thoughts on my uh, rollerblading skills? Um, I'd give you like a C. <laughs> I'll take it. I mean, you passed, but you still have a lot of improvement. <laughs> okay, that's fair. We rain on the top floor. 
I'm here in the beautiful courtyard just behind East 7 Hostel in Prenzlauerberg, Berlin. I'm super excited. We got about half an hour before the show, so we're going to do a little sound check, make sure everything's all set up nicely, and then I'm going to play some songs. I have to thank Izzy at Reckless Clothing for this awesome shirt that I'm wearing. I love it so much. It's the only time I've ever worn a shirt with the name of one of my songs on it, so I'm super pumped. 